Hiya, and welcome to my First World War Victoria Cross series, my academic history blog, dedicated to the original researcher, Mr Jarvis. Part 3. Lieutenant Maurice James Dees, born on the 28th of September 1889 and died the 23rd of August 1914. Born in Gallstown, Cool, in County Westmeath, Dees was an Irish recipient of the Victoria Cross. He was educated at Stonyhurst College before attending the Royal Military College, Sandhurst. Dees was 24 years old and a lieutenant in the 4th Battalion of the Royal Fusiliers when he was killed. In the history of warfare, Lieutenant Dees will always occupy a unique position. He won the first Victoria Cross to be awarded in the First World War and won it on the first day of the first British encounter. On the 23rd of August 1914, Lieutenant Dees, a machine gun officer, was in command of the section placed to protect the crossing of Nimi Bridge, north of Mons, with a single company of Royal Fusiliers. During the action, his position was heavily shelled, and all his men were either killed or incapacitated. He was several times seriously wounded, but refused to leave the guns, remaining near and working them in spite of his wounds, until he was hit for the fifth time, and was carried away to a place of safety, where he died. Private Sidney Godley, who had been assisting the lieutenant while he was still able to operate the guns, took over and alone he used the gun to such good effect that he covered the retreat of his comrades. An extract from the London Gazette dated the 16th of November 1914 records the following. Though two or three times badly wounded, he continued to control the fire of his machine guns at Mons on the 23rd of August, until all his men were shot. He died of his wounds. It is possible to see memorials dedicated to Lieutenant Dees at St. Symphorian Military Cemetery in Belgium. There are plaques on Nimi Bridge and at Westminster Cathedral. His name is also on the Wayside Cross in Woodchester Stroud in Gloucestershire. His Victoria Cross is displayed at the Royal Fusiliers Museum at the Tower of London in England. Please like this video and subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to visit my blogs at academichistoryblog.wordpress.com and at academichistoryblog.tumblr.com and make sure you follow my Twitter page at academicblog. Thank you for listening and hope to see you again soon. Goodbye.